Hello, I'm Lake Speed Jr., Certified Lubrication Specialist with Driven Racing Oil. Welcome back to the third video in our series focusing on direct injection engines and the unique lubrication challenges posed by direct injection engines. This is such a big issue that all the major global OEMs, Ford, Chevy, Chrysler, everybody, is pushing to create a new oil specification called API SN Plus that will change the oil formulations in order to prevent and reduce low speed pre-ignition. The GM DEXO spec has recently been updated to include low speed pre-ignition testing. You see, the way the oil is formulated, specifically the type of detergent additive used in the oil and the amount of those detergent additives used in the oil can actually increase or decrease the tendency and severity of low speed pre-ignition. Specifically, calcium and sodium based detergents can cause low speed pre-ignition. By eliminating sodium detergents, you reduce the tendency of low speed pre-ignition. And by balancing the level of calcium detergent in the oil, you can also reduce the tendency and severity of low speed pre-ignition. While the detergent amount and type is critical, you can also prevent low speed pre-ignition by adding the correct levels of ZDDP, which we all know from flat tappet cams is a critical anti-wear additive, and molybdenum, which is a great friction reducer that we use in racing oils fairly commonly. By balancing the detergent levels with the ZDDP and the molybdenum, you can create an, a package that prevents low speed pre-ignition, reduces soot wear, and provides excellent engine protection for direct injection engines while eliminating the tendency of low speed pre-ignition. If you have any more questions about direct injection engines or low speed pre-ignition, feel free to visit our website at drivenracingwell.com or call our tech line at 1-866-611-1820. Thanks for watching.